Welcome to JSA TV, the newsroom for tech and telecom professionals. I'm Barb Mitchell here at ITW 2019 in beautiful Atlanta uh, with Jamie Leverton, who I'm excited to announce is newly appointed uh, Senior Vice President and Chief Commercial Offer Officer of East Structured Data Centers. Congratulations, Jamie. We're so excited, obviously, to have you here. Thank you so much. I'm incredibly excited to be here. Uh, it's actually a really nice opportunity for me. This is this is week three for me at eStructure. Uh, so to be down here at the show and uh, have so many great meetings and opportunities to really connect with uh, with our partners and our clients, it's it's been an incredible um, entry into the new role. Congratulations, <laughs> yeah. And you had some news uh, come out yes. this week uh, here. It launched, the news came out yesterday, first day of the show. Uh, do you want to tell us what that means uh, for eStructure and uh, the future of the company? Uh, yeah, so yesterday we announced a $170 million um, credit facility, so an expansion of our prior facility, and um, we are, we're very excited for what that, uh, that will allow us to do. Obviously, um, we are a company that's focused on growth and focused on the Canadian market, so uh, it gives us the, uh, the ability to continue to drive that mission with, uh, with haste and excitement. And you're also doing a lot of work around your Channel Partners program. Yes. Can you talk a little bit about that? I know there's going to be more and more coming out about that in the weeks and months to come, but let us know a little bit about it. Yeah, so um, I, I've been blessed to work in technology for the last 20 years, um, and uh, I'm very passionate about the role and importance that Channel Partners play in an organization, and uh, that's that is a focus of mine. Um, it's still early, but uh, as you referenced, we will we will have more news coming out very shortly, um, because our intention is to is to really focus on the channel partner program, being strategic in and how we go to market with our with our partners, uh, and uh, and doing it in a way that really makes sense for both parties. So. I'm excited for the official announcements to come out soon, but uh, it's it's certainly a great opportunity for us. And I just have to plug a little <laughs> bit for Jamie here. Um, you are an official Women of the IT Channel Hall of Fame recipient yes. uh, for Channel Partners. Yes. The work that you've done over the last 20 years, and I think you know it. it as a, as a female leader in our industry, I think it gives you an opportunity to really shine and obviously it, it's a testament to the work that you've done, but what does it mean to you in terms of mentorship opportunities for other young women that are, that are either starting out or, or working through their careers in our industry? Well, um, I do a lot of work in uh, in mentorship with young women coming into our industry. I feel incredibly blessed to have had the career that I have had and to really have started in tech. Um, and there, are, there are, as we all know, there aren't enough senior women in tech. Um, we're working really, really hard to figure out how to change that dynamic. But as one of the few senior executives in technology in Canada, I absolutely believe it's my responsibility um, to mentor and, and be a role model for, the, for that next generation and really to encourage them to come into this space because the career potential is limitless. It is such a fun industry to be a part of. And really, as we look to the, to the future into the next 20, 30, 40 years, I fundamentally believe that tech is going to be a part of every career. So we need to encourage our young women um, and girls. I have two daughters. They, are, uh, they just graduated from grade three and grade five. Um, and I want them to be comfortable with tech, to, to have the same love of it that I do, and to, to embrace whatever that could mean for them in their future. And, and really, um, I think it's important that, uh, that we work hard to open up that communication and make sure that we keep them excited and comfortable with tech. Yeah, thank you. And I've, and I've, you know, we've talked about this before, and I think that it's great what you're, you know, the message that you support on that, and um, you're a great example, obviously. Uh, and so, you know, it's been, uh, you know, 
it's exciting to have you in this role. It's been exciting to watch East Structure grow, expand um, enormously over even the last just even 12 to 18 months. You know, it's been amazing. Um, anything sort of special you want to talk about that uh, you see coming? Other, we've already talked about so many things. There's so many great announcements. You know, uh, what's on the horizon? <clears throat> I, I, there's a lot on the horizon. I, I have never had a busier three weeks in my career. Uh, there is so much going on. There's so much excitement. The team that Todd has assembled is absolutely incredible. Um, really aligned on the same goals, the same passion. The culture is unbelievable. Um, there is no end to things that we have in store uh, over the next few months and, and going into the future. So just keep keep an eye on us and we'll, we'll continue to surprise you. We look forward to it. <laughs> yeah. So thank you so much, Jamie, for joining us here today at ITW 2019. Uh, and thank you, viewers, for tuning in to JSA TV. Happy networking. <laughs>